finally playing Spooky's House and Jump Scoop. And we're playing the feud. And this so, is my home. Can you, humble player, make it through a thousand rooms? Sure, why not? With eyes at the end. Or is there even an end? Because I, I don't really know. Anyway, just, just go. Do 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 this don't scare me too bad. Room number one. Technically, we hadn't even gotten to room number one. This is room. Now we're at room number two. Progress, boys! What the hell? Oh, we got a four post bed. Alright, so what the fuck is all this shit? I can't interact with anything. Spooky, spooky! Spooky, spooky! Don't fucking. I'm just gonna scare the fuck out of me. You'll be fine. Worse than the babies? The, the the beginning of this game is like the most hilarious shit ever, and the end of this game is the scariest shit ever. It has a very very crazy curve. Definitely get used to the sprint mechanic. It's not gonna come in handy right now, but by the time I pick up the control, I have to run. There's hell didn't put that sprint feature in for no goddamn reason. Which, um, and so like you you basically just have to get through the rooms as fast as possible. And like, there's very few things to interact with. Whereas in Layers of Fear, you want to take your time through it, interact with everything you possibly can. So that should be your goal. Just try to get through it as quick as you can. I mean, there's no downside to getting there slowly. It's just a thousand fucking rooms. Don't even fucking bother trying to take time. A shoobity whoop. Choop doop dooby lot. Don't scare me too bad, game. Is that a map? I believe that's what we call a carpet. But it's just every room is circled. Alright, noises. Noise boys. Noise boys. <laughs> oh, no, you motherfucker, man. <laughs> it's a cute little spider. It looks like it came out of Adventure Time. <laughs> whenever you get like a fucking like, bitch whenever you get a choice of multiple doors it really doesn't fucking matter which one yeah as I've, long as they're not locked perfect. oh man that was sad that was that bullshit man that was that was stupid <laughs> fucking cute ass spider ass oh you have a health bar Health bar and a stamina bar. Get killed? Oh hell yeah! And it's it's like a roguelike. You die, you back lose a lot of progress. You don't go back to the beginning necessarily, and there's passwords to like jump you to certain like sections, the the area. Uh, Sammy boy, the jump scares are never that bad. This game isn't really about. See, that's as bad as the jump scares get. Yeah. But the game gets really fucking terrifying towards the end. Uh, terrifying how? Like SCP terrifying. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> it's kind of hard to explain, right? No, it's it's. Think about containment breach. It's that. Containment breach at all? Like, do you remember what containment breach was like? Yeah. There's a bunch of different monsters, and you read about them, and they all had different properties, and they showed up at random. Yep, room fifty. Yeah, good to me. So these are the these are the checkpoint rooms. You get a save point. I'm gonna go ahead. Sweet and, uh, baby Jesus, take the wheel, cross. Boop. Right. Boop. Uh, S S C P is a, the scariest game you've ever fucking yeah, seen no, in your life. Uh, hands down, like without fucking rival, the scariest game ever made. In my opinion is S C P Catan Breach. The second is P T. Like PT, as terrifying as PT is, it does not hold a candle to uh to container breach. Because PT, if you play it over and over again, you eventually get used to the scares. SCP is the you only game get I've used to the ever played where no matter how many times you play it, the scares continue to make you fucking shit your pants every single time. And the worst part about it is that they teach you about the stuff that scares you. They teach you about all the monsters very slowly and very elaborately, and you can look them up and read about them. And that makes them even more terrifying. The more you know about the, the fucking creatures that try to get you, the scarier they are. And that's very unique to SCP. Um, hey. Not. 
Very much. Oh, okay, I'm going down now. Keep that blood pumping! Oh, there's a note here. At first, this place seemed cute, and I've been here for days now. I'm feeling quite parched now, and I keep getting this feeling like I'm being watched by someone. This is not romantic at all. Why would it be romantic? Where the fuck is it supposed to be? I don't know who that guy is, but he thinks everything's fucking romantic. This is me. <laughs> what the hell, Resident Evil door? That was a Resident Evil door. <laughs> yeah, this game takes a lot of inspiration from a lot of stuff. Most notably, other fucking SCP, but we haven't reached that That's yet. That's fucking terri- that's fucking terrifying. <laughs> Brother, this game takes influence from the scariest game ever created. Yes. It's- it's very not spoopy in the beginning, though. <laughs> the fucking spiders. Hey! Fuck you. Sometimes these have notes on them, but right now. I, put, I probably should have checked the first. You would have seen them. They were like slapped on the face. Oh. You gotta like learn how to like run optimally in this game. Because when you're out of stamina 100%, it charges slowly. Hmm. But like when you have a bunch, it charges fast. You gotta like turn it on and off like this. Also, these rooms, like they're like mazes, right? You can see through the walls, but sometimes they lead to dead ends. You gotta guess which way is not a dead end. Right, because the. Yep. Dead end. And hypothetically, if something were chasing you in these kinds of rooms, making a wrong turn... Death. Yeah. Oh shit, we're in jail. Yeah. I've never seen this Going to jail now! Somebody... Ooh, so this is a thing that I'm not what gonna touch. What is that? Goop, when you walk into it, it hurts. moves slower. Bowing, splashing, soaking, innards, ingest, invoking, nailing, never stops the choking. Okay. I... Whoa, so... oh! oh! Now I gotta run. Monsters follow you from room to room. Are you serious? Yes. Can't jump over that shit? Lord, bro. Oh god, fucking bitch ass. That actually got me. How many rooms will he follow you through? Oh shit! As long as he keeps seeing that that green splatter, he can keep showing up. Oh, that's, so that's that's his thing. That's his hallmark, yeah. Okay. Every enemy. No! Yo, oh, shit! He's coming for fucking... him. He's, he's still chasing me. Something scratched your fucking face. Yeah, my, I took damage. Slowly recover health. You recover yeah, faster when you're walking slowly. I see. But you don't want to walk slowly if you're still being chased, which I am, because I can still see that green goop. Every monster has a way to determine if they're chasing you, regardless yep. of whether or not you let's you see them. Fuck. And so that green goop is the way that, know, that I know that that dude's chasing me. I can still see the green goop. Oh god. The highlights. This dude can go through walls. So this is the worst room to encounter him in. See him? Oh, I see him. He's a fucking ghost boy. Oh so shit, which run? way? Uh, I guess right. Ah, no, this is wrong. Fuck. Very still wrong. Good, you're still good, you're still good. Holy fuck. Oh god, I'm oh stuck god. in the fucking corner. Still chasing me. Safe? Uh. Okay, I think I'm safe. Alright, my health's back to full, so I'm good. Oh, man! That is tense. Holy fuck nuggets, man. I want to run though because yeah fuck. yeah just cuz fuck it why not why not run for your life sometimes rooms lead to dead ends mm -hmm. and you gotta like turn back and take another choice what like doors lead to dead ends yep Holy and sometimes shit. you gotta go back the way you came what's that mrs spook all right let's play mrs spook hey, hey! Uh, uh, uh. what the fuck kind of pac-man is this oh shit watch out i'm the ghost Oh, you're the- God damn! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> oh my god, man. Oh, that was the best! Alright, what's this game? All of the spook. I can't choose anything but start. Damn! Oh my goodness! I actually like these graphics for those characters. Yeah. Cute. For in like a gruesome way. 
Well, it's, it's all cute until they fuck, their fucking heads explode from being stabbed. You're really good at this game. Really easy. Yeah. Stabbing somebody like barely recharges it. <laughs> I know. Losing it way faster than you can. They're just going. They're just trying to chill at the mall. Game over. All right. Boogie. Hey. All right. That was cool. Was that an ATM? <laughs> this is a broken machine. All right. That was cool. Cool little diversion. I think there's another game that you can find. <laughs> he said, I'm the ghost. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, watch out. I'm like, I'm the ghost. <laughs> I ain't got to watch out for nothing. <laughs> I thought you were pack thing. <laughs> fucking pack retard. He was just like, I thought you were puck man. He was just fucking Whoa. hovering in circles and shit. <laughs> ah! Fucking bitch. Fuck. Oh yeah, sometimes they're locked too. Again, really sucks really to get chased. Again, chase, yeah. Thank God I was not getting chased. So how many monsters have you encountered? Hey, that would look like Lumpy Space Princess. I've never played this game before. I've just seen other people play it. Oh, okay. I've seen all kinds though. Technically, the 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 jump scare cardboard cutouts are also a monster. But they can't deal damage to you unless you have like a heart attack and die. <laughs> Just putting you into a fucking wall. Oh, cool. Yeah. God, I haven't hit any dead ends yet in terms of these rooms. So you can actually. Oh, oh hey. whoa, whoa. Oh. I knew something was following me, but I feel like I'm prancing through the same rooms over and over. Hopefully, leaving notes as breadcrumbs will prove I'm making progress and reaching some destination. I just hope I don't run out of ink. I'm dreadfully thirsty. Hmm. All right, save point. Game there saved. Sorry, I made it a little sweaty. Yep, you this game did. was a little fucking sweat-inducing. You did. I mean, I didn't show it, but that was actually kind of fucking terrifying. <laughs>